Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own DIY shoes. What you're going to need for this, some tape, two trash bags, old pair of socks with no holes in them, and some Plasti Dip. You're going to start by putting the trash bags on your feet. So you're going to put the socks on now. And there we go, socks are on. Now we're gonna get our plastic spray, plastic dip. And we're gonna spray it on our feet. Now, you, you, you most likely want to be in a sunny spot while doing this, because it may take a little while to dry and you don't wanna be sitting here holding your feet up for however long. So yeah, let's get started. On the bottom, we're gonna want a thicker coating than on the top, obviously, because that's where all the friction and things is going to be happening. Just keep that in mind. All right, so we've let these dry for a little while. Now we're gonna add the second coating. They're a little bit sticky and everything, but you just wanna let them dry a little bit. Because that's gonna help the Plasti, Plasti Dip adhere to the actual Plasti Dip rather than soaking further in the sock. We want an outside coating on the socks. All right, so we're done adding our second layer. Now we're gonna let them dry a little bit, take them off, and patch up any of the remaining spots. All right, so the socks have dried pretty well. We're gonna go ahead and pop them off. All right, so. Oh, I guess they weren't completely dry, as you can see. They are a little um, wrinkled and such, but Go ahead and lay them down. And we're just gonna deliver a healthy coating to both of these. With plastic spray, with the little bit we have left. All right, so we're gonna let those dry and completely and then we're gonna go try them out. So we're back, we got the DIY shoes on and ready. As you can see, pretty dry, pretty crusty. And we're gonna do a little test with them, so let's walk around and give them a try. Pretty comfy, no feelings of discomfort. Running now. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. In the grass. Overall, these shoes work really well, really cheap. Give them a try, guys. I'm not advising that these shoes are a substitute for more traditional shoes, but they are definitely a fun experiment to try, and they're cheap. So if you're penny pension or on a budget, I guess you could wear these around. Or if you're in some sort of weird survival situation where you had Plasti Dip and some socks, you could make you some shoes. Now you could do this experiment with any sort of socks that you like so long as they don't have holes in them. If your socks do have holes in them, it's not going to work very well and you're going to have holes in the actual shoes that you make. Um, the coating is very thick on the bottom if you make it very thick and that really helps for absorbency 
and impact and things like that. Um, I wouldn't recommend going and walking on nails or any sort of construction sites because you may be in some you may be in some trouble like that. But I mean, it's a it's a really thick coating. You can do all kinds of things like this. Now, when I thought of this experiment when I recorded this, I thought I was going to be the pioneer of DIY shoes, right? Well, turns out that's not the case. It's already been done before. Um, there's multiple YouTube videos on it, and I'm by no means trying to take credit for this experiment or this idea. So go check out those YouTube videos. I'm sure you'll be able to find them if you just search DIY shoes. You may have already seen them. Uh, just a disclaimer to let you guys know. Hope you enjoyed. Peace.